Whole Life Green Living Models. One Community Weekly Progress Update number 107. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for profit and non profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. This is our weekly progress update number 107, March 22nd, 2015 edition. As always, I'm going to be covering our team's progress and accomplishments for the last seven days. And if you'd like more details, more specifics, if you'd like to access links to all the open source content, everything associated with everything I'm going to be talking about, you can visit our written blog. Also, if you'd like to receive an email every time one of these updates comes out, you can join our email list by sending an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com, or you can subscribe to this YouTube channel. Let's jump into the updates. One community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, a learner, teacher, collaborative, and it includes U.S. Common Core standards. This week, the core team, which includes the Pioneer and Satellite members, plus those helping who don't wish to be individually acknowledged, added the yellow and green sections to the Technology and Innovation Molecule webpage, which you can see here. This subject page covers the greatest minds, inventions, and creations of all time, plus learning strategies, test-taking strategies, technology implementation, systems theory and analysis, and more. Paige Allison Donatelli, graphic designer and owner-operator of Namaste Living in a Material World, also finished another 25% of the image creation for the Civilization lesson plan. This brings us to 75% complete on that mind map, and when totally complete on the site, this lesson plan will teach all subjects to all learning levels in any learning environment using the central civilization theme. Paige also helped us create this new social media imagery for promoting the relative and dimensional space lesson plan, which we featured this last week. If you'd like to help with this education program, we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined, and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This week the core team working on highest good food finished the final social media imagery and featured our open source carrots hub. We also did this for our food forest understory plantings hub. In addition to this, we researched and added the final major components to the open source corn hub recipes. You can see these new additions here. We also did this for the open source cucumbers hub. And these first recipe lists will grow as our food experts continue the process of designing the food self-sufficiency transition plan. Speaking of food experts, Benjamin Sessions finished all the recipes and images for the second half of week four of the food self-sufficiency transition plan. You can see these four new recipes here. In support of diversity, all these recipes are omnivore recipes that can easily be made vegan too. And when complete, we'll have a full six months of menus and recipes for people to reference during their own remote village creation process. Sandra Solani, vegan chef and author of What's Your QB, also finished another vegan recipe, black bean, barley, and Swiss chard soup. You can see this recipe also on the Food Cell Sufficiency Transition Plan page. In this area of our open source project, we are seeking permaculturalists, an irrigation specialist, a surveyor, and a chef to join our team as either consultants to the project or pioneers who will be moving onto the property with us. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, 
and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This week, the core team working on Highest Good Housing continued laying out the specifics for the open source Murphy Bed Furniture Assembly details behind the scenes. These are part of the Earthbag Village and crowdfunding campaign plan, and new updates included more steps for cutting lumber and labeling pieces for the two nightstands and assembling nightstand frames. What you see here is all this behind the scenes work in progress. We estimate we're now 57% complete with what is needed for the website. Also behind the scenes, we finished another 10% of the Earth Dome Loft construction tutorial specifics. This brings us to 20% complete there, and the images you see here are just some of this work that has been done so far. We additionally created this new social media imagery and featured our complete Earthbag Village time investment page. And we also added the work of Scott Thomas and his Shadow Ridge Signature Architecture Program team to the Earthbag Village main open source hub and the Earth Dome furniture page. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master plumber and a master electrician. If you or someone you know would like to help with this component of our open source creation process. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This week, the core team completed the final 40% of the thermostatic shower valve and heat lamp energy and water savings open source page. This shares the work and calculations of Ron Payne, mechanical engineer and HVAC thermal designer. What you see is a complete and open source resource covering our rationale and additional test saving strategies plan for using this hardware, timers, and in shower heat lamps for saving energy and water in both the Duplicable City Center and the Earthbag Village. For this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer and a general contractor. The structural engineer is somebody that we're seeking to help us design the cupola so it can be built without a crane, which is very important for our open source goals and duplication anywhere in the world. And the general contractor is needed for assistance in conjunction and collaboration with P2S Engineering, who is helping us with the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing section of this structure. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. This week the core team created this image and featured our Becoming a Community Member page. Behind the scenes, we finished the first draft of Socially Responsible Entrepreneurship for the People's Agenda 21 rewrite of Agenda 21 and began putting together the web page. We also finished the first draft of the Radioactive Waste Chapter rewrite for People's Agenda 21. These images are, of course, behind the scenes. Last but not least, we finished our web translation tutorial web page, which you can see here. This new tutorial page features the work of Jin Hua, internet marketing expert and web developer, teaching what's needed for translating any page of our site into another language. In this area of the project, we're seeking graphic designers, web designers, and technology specialists, videographers, and building a highest good legal team. If you or someone you know fits these descriptions and would like to join our highest good society creation process. One community is creating whole life green living models. What this means is we're taking the foundations of sustainability and green living and we're combining this with emotional sustainability components as well to create a holistic approach to self-sufficient and self-sustainable teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs that can be built around the world. Our idea is to open source and free share the foundations of sustainable living, including food, energy, housing, highest good economics, which is for-profit, non-profit business creation, education, fulfilled living models, and true earth stewardship, putting all these things together so that they can be built and duplicated as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs to be built around the world and to teach others how to build teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs as well. Our idea is if we make it easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrate as attractive enough that this idea of whole life green living models will spread on its own. And we think that this is the approach to total transformation of our planet to one that works for everybody. And to accomplish this goal, we're bringing together people with a consciousness for the highest good of all. We're bringing together people that believe that it's possible, realize that the way that we're living right now is not sustainable and would like to do something else, 
and we're creating the open source and free shared blueprints, tools, tutorials, do-it-yourself instructions to duplicate everything that we're doing, either as individual components or the complete teacher demonstration village and hub, so that we can change this world in our lifetime. So if this sounds fun to you, if this sounds exciting to you, if this sounds interesting to you, if this sounds like something that you'd like to be a part of, then we invite you to join us. We have lots of different ways to participate, including joining us as either pioneer members, which are the people who will be moving on to the property to build one community, or as satellite members, or as partners and consultants, consulting behind the team, just donating their time, and helping out in the ways that they can behind the scenes. We're an all-volunteer, unpaid organization. And we've been working for years now on developing and designing this model so that it can be implemented anywhere in the world so that it has the diversity of options that humanity would need to want to duplicate this anywhere in the world. And so, as I've said before, so it will be easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrate as attractive enough so it will spread on its own. Now, people ask, what is the number one thing that I could do to help one community right now? And we are still seeking large-scale funding. The number one thing that we could do that we would, we would love help with right now is getting the property off the market property we've been working with now for four years still in the market and until we get that property off the market we can't open source and free share and do a lot of the other elements that are necessary to take the project to the next level which is boots on the ground doing on-site surveying and taking everything that we've developed and starting to modify and adapt it to that specific property and then teaching others how to do that too so that people that are looking at our open source blueprints tools tutorials resources all the whole life green living models aspects so that we can teach people how to modify those for a specific property. And that's a big part of what it is that we're up to as well. So another way that people can help is just by sharing our information on social media. We are on all the different social media networks. We are on Sue, which is our favorite social media network and the one that we post to the most. We're also on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Reddit, Tumblr, uh, Pinterest. We're on all Twitter. We're on all the different social media networks to make it as easy as possible to access and share our information. So sharing our information in those networks helps to get the word out, helps us to spread our open source blueprints, tools, tutorials, and offerings, and helps more people to understand what it is that we're doing. Because the reality of it is, is whole life green living models being implemented around the world is just a matter of participation. And so the more people that know about us, the more people we can find that are interested in helping and the more people that get involved and the faster we can create and complete all of our open source blueprints, tools, tutorials, and resources, everything that we're doing so that people have access to those and can start building different iterations, multiple versions and iterations and uh, examples of what it is that we're creating so more and more people can see the different ways it can be done and get involved. And thus the exponential growth happens. So, as always, thank you for following our progress. Uh, thank you for all the emails that we get. Thank you for all the comments that we get on our Facebook posts. Uh, thank you for the small donations, because as an all-volunteer all unpaid staff, um, those small donations help us cover all the basic things like internet fees, website fees, that kind of stuff, for, corporate fees, all the little, little costs and expenses associated with running a global organization like ours. And, of course, uh, thank you for watching this video. And until next week, we will keep on keeping on. Thank you.